welcome in. Can I have your name? Bro, I can't imagine a fella just walking into a room and you just hear mad pops. Pop, pop, pop. I'll probably walk away, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. I wouldn't waste my time. I'm going home after that. My name is Moan. Moan? Moan. Like, make Mon? you moan. Come yeah. on. Okay. Nah, what do you do? I have a video production make company called crazy. Dreamcast Video. Mm. And I'm also a, a, a brand, so I'm Moan on a Beat. This <laughs> nigga <laughs> like 50 years old. Moan on a Beat is nasty work. <laughs> Gone over to some of these ladies and see why they ended up popping. All right, if we can have your name and age. I'm Alexis and I'm 29. Alexis, why did you pop your balloon? I didn't really like the make you moan gotcha. statement. And um, you kind of look like coming to America right now. Good morning, my <laughs> I see you're used to dealing with peasants, so you don't know when you see a king. Okay. okay. <laughs> I ain't really feeling her feet. <laughs> yeah, I'm hot right now, so. <laughs> <laughs> but the feet ain't working for me, so. Okay. <laughs> definitely pretty, but you could look like Holly Berry. If you ain't got pretty feet, I ain't rocking with it. Bless yeah. up. You like you seem you like. like a funny guy. You just see, I love to laugh, but it's just giving real gimmicky. Sure. That's that's really it to me. Okay. It's just giving gimmicky, the moan statement. Make moan? you moan, yeah. Oh. It's just giving gimmick to me. Cool. Is Tiffany someone that's your type? Nah. And why not? She fired. The fit is kind of cheesy to me. Kind of looking a little bit. Rain What's wrong with her fit? She looks valid to me. Rainbowish. Rainbowish. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm not. I'm not one that do lace fronts. Pretty feet. Thank you. Cool outfit. People saying I'm gimmicky. The outfit look kind of gimmicky. I mean, <laughs> but um, it's better than yours. It's better than mine. It's better than. And um, yours. I can see through it all, and you're beautiful. You seem like you have like an aura that's that's really glowing. Feel it in my soul. Feel it in my soul. I make sweet potato pies because a good sweet potato pie is something that you oh, feel. What is this, bro? Oh, that is fat. James with James Gourmet Pies, 37. If we, oh, okay, that's him. Oh, he makes. Oh, that was bro. Because a good sweet potato pie is something that you feel. Oh, that is fabulous. Oh, okay. It makes okay, sense. if we can have your name and age. James with James Gourmet Pies, 37. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is James with James Gourmet Pies, mm -hmm. 37, mm -hmm. and pies. I like that you make pies, though. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank yeah. you. Thank you. We ship nationwide, jamesgourmet.com. James Gourmet, okay. <laughs> okay. If we can have your name and age. James Gourmet Pies, 37. Name like okay, and James, you had your balloon unpopped. Why so? Pies. Okay, if we can start with your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. James Gourmet Pies. Oh, it's a bro. This nigga be going on every platform promoting them pies. I me, mean, I respect the hustle, but nigga, they not, they don't care about your pies, gang. It's going over here. <laughs> we can have your name and age. My name is James Gourmet Pies. Facebook, Instagram, check me out. <laughs> your name and age, oh, and why you ended up popping bro. your balloon? James Gourmet Pies, thirty-seven. Which me? My name is Dr. Elam, and you may know me from the popular Pop the Balloon show. On See, we're here look a little, look a little, you know, I ain't trying to say it, but y'all know what I'm about to say, bro. I don't know, it was like, nah. I'm Dude, but I'm here to say- you seem a little, I'm you know, a little off. My name is Dr. Elam, I'm 38 years old, and I pop my balloon just because you're simply too young. How old are you again? 38. Damn. I'm sorry. <laughs> You're 38? Oh, yeah. Red flag. So he's... He's a in the back. But it's flag. less about being a red flag <laughs> and more about being a liability. I get it. If I were to bring you into my life, mm -hmm. you would be a liability. <laughs> I mean, if you change your mind, I'm open to it, though. Oh, really? God. For real. Why would you be open to it? Because you're handsome. So you only like and me because I'm beautiful. Bro, like he seemed a little sweet a little bit. I'm going to just say it, bro. He seemed a little sweet, bro. I don't know. I don't know. I'm qu we seem a little questionable, bro. I'm beautiful. Yeah, but that's not why I would only like you. So why would you like me? Because you didn't answer that. Because you can bring something and add something to my mm -hmm. life. But because you're a liability, I you right. can't know add that. anything to my life. Right. You would be a liability to everything in so my life. So what can I not add to? Like, what, what is that? You can't teach me anything. You can't. Bro, he don't even know her. He just, bro, he don't even know her. <laughs> Help me with my finances in any way. You can't add any intellectual 
anything <laughs> into my life. And it's not because you're not capable. It's just because you're not I'm there so yet. Young. You're not there yet. Right. And if you're not already on that path. I'm already on it. That's the problem. You don't know enough about me. Yeah, you don't you're know her. You're absolutely right. I don't so know enough about up. you. You said you've had, you have Airbnb properties. Good luck with the other girls back there. Oh. Me personally, I wouldn't take this level of disrespect. Well, I pretty much said you're nothing right now. Like, you're nothing, and that's it. Next. Oh. I can tell that you're triggered, and that's okay. I'm not triggered, sweetheart. We can, but, work, we can work through this together. You Please said put I your can't hands bring down. you anything. Put your hands down. You can't bring said, anything right now. Good luck now. with the other girls. Say, okay, so, and this is why your immaturity <laughs> will prevent you from being with a real man. Your immaturity. <laughs> your immaturity. No, I've dealt with real Because you're not before. listening to me and you're trying to talk <laughs> over me. I'm listening. Adults have conversations. I'm listening. Okay? If we were to get together, you would be asking me questions like, Dr. Elam, what did you do to acquire everything that you acquired? What did you do to learn everything that you learned? What type of <laughs> habits and skills do you have that can help me get to where I want to get? <laughs> Bro is trying to destroy her for no Who reason. Who are you? You have two Airbnb properties. Mm. How can we get to four? I Eight. already know how to do that. Next contestant, please. Please. <laughs> you free for a dance? Sure. Yo. I need information. Is, is I was molested by information. I'm a dancer and I own a topless cleaning company called Tidy Titties. Hey, that's pretty good. The reason I pop my balloon is seems like Stripper Junior. Like, that's stripper Junior? No, I like the idea. I think you make a lot of money. There's a lot of men that would pay for that. I probably would pay for that myself as a single man. And now, is he your type? No, he's not my type. Okay, and what makes him not your type? The skin, you know? Black? Okay. Yeah. No, so, so... <laughs> what did you say, nigga? <laughs> Do you like clear skin? Yeah, like, you know. I don't even know if it's an overbite, but it would be the... Yeah. Her overbite? I'm, I'm certified. I'm a dental assistant <laughs> as well. So. All right. Thank you so much. Let's go ahead and go on to our next guy over okay. here. All right. And if we can have your name and how old you are and why you ended up popping your balloon. What's the name of your business? Tiny Titties? Tidy Titties. Tidy Titties. Oh. <laughs> Daryl, why did you end up leaving your balloon unpopped for her? I, I ain't going to lie. When I heard the titties, it uh, oh, kept me yeah. interested. Oh. Okay. I ain't, ain't going to lie to you. Okay. Seeing titties cleaning, I'm, I'm, I'm cool with that. Yeah, see, some people <laughs> like it. So I ain't, I ain't gonna lie to you. You don't see you have the crib cleaning with your, with your shirt off. I, I can't say no to There's that. There's nothing wrong with it, but you're not about to be my girlfriend at somebody else's crib with your titties out cleaning their crib. Yeah. Right. So <laughs> keep another, I'm keeping the honey. If you have the crib, your shirt off cleaning, I'll make sure the house dirty. <laughs> I got a whole body full of blunt skin. <laughs> 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 to show your nipples, you, you got a tank top on under your jacket. Get your butt <laughs> And now is Fiona your type? She fine. I'm not gonna lie to you. I know this is showing everything. You are fine. Thank um, you. She is my type for sure. But I mean, she popped the balloon. It's all good. I'm not tripping. But yeah, you. Thank you. you. Yeah, for sure. You got a nice. Look. Yeah. Let's go over to our next lady. <laughs> she definitely fine. I think it's an attraction thing for me. You you seem like a cool homegirl, so I I, I mess with. You. I'm not lie to you. Oh, okay. you, oh, you look banging. I'm a lady. She's shady. You cannot be for real. I'm a lady. Oh my god, you for real? I'm a lady. Bro, I hate no, girls that's so serious like that. I can't, bro, I don't like that type. I don't like that, bro. I like my girl to be goofy a little bit. Like, be my bro a little bit. For me, like, pause. Not for me, not like on no diddy shit, but like, I like my girl to be fun, bro. Like, be like a more of a friend than like, for me, like, bro, one thing I feel like with relationships, bro, they be too serious, bro. When you keep it fun, they last longer, bro, my opinion. You for fake. No, you she for too real. serious. I'm a lady. I don't like that. I don't like that. <sighs> I'm a lady. You lying. Oh, okay, I got you. Just the fidgety. He seemed very like, you, you gotta hone it in, bring it together. I understand. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I was Taylor your type? Nah. Okay, nah. why not? You want a spirit it had really thrown me off, the Willy Wonka thing. <laughs> I didn't really like it like that. Um, I like the, no, no, I mean, I like the dress, the two that's showing okay, right well, here. Okay, well, the nice. back of your head is ridiculous, so <laughs> it's kind of flat. <laughs> you <mean> talking <laughs> about ah! Bro, it is flat though. He got this type of head. <laughs> yeah. I, I'll be honest with you. Yeah. Uh, you mean that? You mean that? You mean that? I don't really care about the back of my head. I care about the front, but it's all good. Hey, <laughs> I appreciate you. I appreciate people. <laughs> huh? Okay. But I fucks with you. You cool, people. All right, bye-bye. Okay. Later, Tay-Tay.
Little Tay Tay. <laughs> pushing me to be better, and I thought it'd be fitting to ask you this question oh, here, sure. since we met in news, Cornelia and Nichols. <laughs> I know the two baby mothers kind of rubs you the wrong way, right? Like, so were you about to pop my balloon or? I don't know, I was thinking two baby moms, but they grown though, it was a long time. Yeah, a long time. Mm -hmm. um, it's kind of young moving, kind of kind of fast. Right, How, you said you're 37? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I would like to get to know you better. Okay, mm -hmm. likewise. Yeah. Right. Okay, we got a match. <laughs> A few moments later. So, I just told him, you know, I'm free all day tomorrow. Let Everybody me know what you want to do. Yes, so, we had our plan. <laughs> yeah, energy. He was like, I want to see you first thing in the morning. I'm like, okay, cool. We're both morning people. Mm -hmm. We met that morning and we got smoothies. Mm -hmm. And he took me to the river. What's the name of that river, baby? Uh, Tempe Town. Are they together for all they together after that show? That's hard. What? Yeah, like, Check that out. Okay. Something like, you know. Yeah, hanging out there, talking right. on the bench. Right. And then we went to get some food right. um, at Chopped. Yeah. A few moments later. I know for a fact that Kay was put into my life for a reason. Wow. I know that there is nobody else like you. You are an amazing friend. You are genuine. You only can pretend to be somebody for so long. But the truth eventually comes out, and you have been consistent. You have been kind, you have been sweet. I want to spend the rest of my life with you. And I, I don't feel like I'm rushing. I mean, honestly. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Bro. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Are you serious? Whoa. Oh. Why would he be playing around? Nicole, I love you deeply, man. And we are moving at our own pace. Bro, Regardless of anybody cool. else's opinion, you are a special woman. And when a man knows, he knows. And I believe from the Bro, bottom of my heart, I'm a person, my best friend, the person I'm supposed to spend the rest of my life with, and just have a good time, and just enjoy this ride together. So will you do me the honor and be my wife? Yes! Bye. Bro, what? You telling me I gotta go on a talk show to find my wifey? I gotta go on a, a pop balloon episode of... To find my shorty, bro? That is tough. That's crazy, bro. I ain't go. <laughs> Salute to that king, man. Bro, he found he found his shorty. He found his wife up here, bro. It's possible, fellas. It's possible. Yeah, man. Sign me up for that.